Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial. Today we are going to learn about the Razor Pay integration using the Flask. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So first of all, let me add this OTP to complete the transaction. 631816. Okay, continue. And here you can see that the payment successful and it will redirect me that the payment successfully done. Okay. So here you can see that and in our Razor, Razor Pay, you can just check it out over here. Let me just log in. So here we have. Okay. And if I go to my transactions, so currently we have 500, right? So let's see. So there is a payment ID with this. This is captured. Okay, this is 500. Previous one is created but failed, but this is captured. And here you can see that the whole transaction details over there, right? This payment ID, order ID, settlement, all the data that the card I have entered and the email I have entered. Okay, so everything is there. So it's locked and you can just get it out. Okay, so let's dive into the code level how we have implemented and once again also we can just check it out. So here you can just click on the pay, the Razor Pay screen will come, whatever payments you want to choose, you can choose and proceed with that one. Okay, so this is a test mode, right? Okay, now let's dive into the code one. So how we have implemented that one. So here we go with our code base. Okay, so very easy, very simple. So here we have to just add our HTML file like this. Okay, this is our URL for the Razor Pay style sheet. If you want to use, you can use the styles. Okay, so here we have a button with 500. Pay button with add listener. We are using when we click on it, we are going to call an API for the create order. Okay, and we have to pass the amount, headers accordingly. Okay, after this, these are the options that we have to send for the transactions to be created. Like your business, your order ID, currency and everything amount. Okay, after this, we have a verify payment so api that will verify that part and it will give me that the payment successful otherwise alert payment verification failed and this is just open after that we can close it okay and the main file that is this one so here we have this one so here we have a razor pay api credentials that we have to add and we have to import the necessary things over there okay after this on the home route we have a checkout.html files which we have already done and uh, you have to pass the Razor Pay key ID, the create order endpoint. What we have to do, like we have to just get the amount NIR that is for the currency and payment the capture auto capture. Okay, and return that just justify order. Okay, and for the verify payment, we have the route and let's get the payment ID, order ID, and the signature. After that, we have a verify payment signature utility in the whatever package we have installed that is the Razor Pay. So here you can see that which package I'm um, installed. Here you can see that that is pip installed Razor Pay. So make sure you have to install this pip package. Okay. So utility we have verify payments with that details and it will say that the status success or the status fail on the behalf of it. We are going to do the redirection part here. You can see that here verify dot status. It will, if it would be success, then alert that the payment is successful. Otherwise, there would be an issue on that. Okay. So this is how you can do the Razor Pay integration in your Flask app. Any doubt, any query in that, do let me in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.